What's up gangs, njroot22.com here with another supermarket roundup vlog. Now what are we gonna talk about today? Um, I got these things late, I normally film these during the day. So I'm just gonna run through these quick. Kings, again, not really much to talk about. I don't think I even circled anything because uh, it's either too expensive or it's just not good for you. But uh, I just wanted to show you how expensive their Bel Gioso fresh mozzarella log is. Nine bucks. It's like three dollars, three fourth dollars at Shoprite. And it's, it's ridiculous. Um, you got uh, IGA, which is Bishops of White House. You can see they have a little, little masthead there, or bottom. Um, Again, we shop here local because we wanted to see them stay in business. But, you know, just to show you, I mean, like they have uh, these, they have Eggsland's best uh, eggs cheaper than ShopRite this week, if you're interested. And they're also going, uh, doing the whole Jersey Fresh promotion that we mentioned uh, last week on the blog, njroot22.com, in case you want to know why we're doing this. Um, but yeah. So that's the big thing now, all this local food instead of getting it from some other country. <clears throat> but uh, you know, I just wanted to point out a couple things this week. They have a good deal. If you have kids and you uh, like these uh, Yo Kids, Yo Kids yogurt, they're, uh, that's a good price. That's like I think a buck, buck or so more uh, less than, than other places, regular price. And there's one other thing I wanted to point out. Oh, if you, uh, if you if you insist on eating ketchup, and it's not bad to have every now and then, you gotta watch out for the sugar content. But they have a good uh, deal on Annie's organic ketchup. It, that has a really good tomato taste, from what I recall. There's a couple uh, ketchups out there that had profound tomato taste. Other, most of them just taste like tangy sugar paste. Um, and that's it uh, for Bishop. And we're gonna talk about something really exciting here. Um, ShopRite is gonna, is, this is exciting for us at least. They're getting a new, a brand new flyer. Let me see if I can make that look good. Your flyer will have a brand new look. And I'm guessing, is it gonna be like a book style, like Walmart or Wegmans has a book style? Or, or is it gonna be like uh, Stop and Shop where they had a lot of white space and it was easier to read? I'm wondering if they're going to reduce the number of sale items they have every week. Because ShopRite really has like hundreds, hundreds of items in there. But let's get to see what what uh, ShopRite has this week. Uh, they got the Jersey tomatoes for a buck forty nine. I always found found those to be gamey and, and rather lacking in flavor. But some people like them. I guess um, I don't know. And they have grapes. Uh, I kind of stay away from grapes because you end up eating way too many of them. And I think those also are very uh, sugary as well. But if you really want grapes, they have a super coupon this week for 97 cents a pound. That's a pretty darn uh, good deal, I guess. Oh, and I want to tell you something here. See these Chips Ahoy? I remember eating them as a kid um, to an extent. But uh, parents just buy these for their kids now. Just Then the kids just sit there and mindlessly shovel them in their mouth. That's not a good snack to give your children at all. Why do they do it? It's just, come on, look out for your kids. We got a lot of markings this week in the, in the uh, ShopRite flyer. They got Wholesome Pantry, they have a sale on there. It's not organic, but it's like a pretty healthy chicken. I think it's made by Reddington Farms, and they told me once what it, what it was. No sweets, no sweets. They have it on sale uh, starting Sunday, July 29th. 25% off. That's good chicken. Never, never, never treated us wrong. The chicken I think you should avoid is Coleman because I'm telling you how many times it smelled like fish. I swear, it's like disgusting. And they also have some. They have, Wholesome Pantry has good uh, organic uh, frozen vegetables. Those are those are one of the few things we buy frozen here because uh, you can use them in a pinch. You know. Okay, and what else we have here? Yeah, see how the Eggland's best is a lot cheaper at Bishops this week. Um, and I, I marked this off because I think if you could find a local farm that, that sells the eggs on the side of the road, those those taste the best, without a doubt. Then again, you have you have the uh, Shoprite shredded cheeses. Those are those are just the, always in our fridge. We like them. 
And something I want you to watch out for is yogurt. And I'm gonna do a brief thing on yogurt today. It, yogurt's not good for you. I mean, not, not, not in the way they sell it in the store. It's just, it's basically like eating like a sugar cream pie, you know? And look at all the, the, like they go big, they go big. And this is obviously a sponsored listing from Dannon. Um, they really want you to buy their, their yogurt. Um, the Greek yogurt, the full fat yogurt, those, those are the best if you have to eat yogurt. And don't buy flavored ones. Uh, put your own fruit in. Usually blueberries or strawberries make good uh, filling in those things. Okay, what else do we have here? Oh God, I mean, these monster drinks. Not only are they expensive and filled with chemicals, they're just, just why do people like them? What, they must put something addictive in it. Seriously. Oh, here's a new item I'm interested in uh, trying. I've never heard of it before. It's called Herdez, Herdez. Guacamole salsa. It looks interesting. It looks like it might might be uh, up my alley. I bet y'all forget about it. What else do we have? Another two things that I pointed at that, that struck my eyes. The K-Cups. I don't know who fell for that ease and convenience of a disgusting cup of coffee. Uh, and they're expensive and they get you on this reusable Gillette model where you just have to constantly buy these K-Cups. Talk about it. hope no environmentalists uh, buy those things because those like so much plastic for every cup of coffee. It's like, ridiculous. And, lo and look how cheap sugar is, by the way. It's 50 cents a pound. Why do you think they make it so cheap? And uh, here's a good deal on... That's a good deal on the Cottonelle. And that's probably the best brand at the supermarket. It lasts for a long time. And what else do we have? I think that's it for this week. I'm really excited to see what ShopRite... Oh, here, one last thing. These Nature's Truth Vitamins. Ah, they, they, I don't, I think they, I don't think they work. I, I know this is gonna, but I, I, I'm looking forward to seeing what, uh, what their new flyer looks like. Cause this, this flyer is, uh, this is outdated. This matched like the size of like the Bergen Record or the New York Times. It, it's just too big. So we'll see. Well, I'll be excited to share what the new flyer looks like. And that's it for this week. Off to do another video.